Microsoft secretly rolled out extension support in Edge for Android. That means it's possible to download extensions on your mobile device just like you install in Edge browser for desktop. The feature is in early stage of development and available behind the flags. In case you can wait to try extension feature in Edge for Android, then you have to enable it manually and here is how you can do that. Before that, I am trying to hit 1000 subscribers on YouTube. Please consider subscribing to the channel as this encourages me in creating more similar videos. Alright, update Edge browser to the latest version available. After that, in the address bar, you need to type edge colon forward slash forward slash flags and hit enter. Here search for the flag name Android extension. When the same flag appears in the search results, using the drop down next to it, change settings from default to enable. After that, tap on the restart button. This will enable the extension feature in Edge browser. To access extension or install the extension, tap on the hamburger icon on the bottom right corner. In the menu that open, swipe left and tap all menu. Here you will find puzzle icon, tap on it. This will open extension page, which you can see is in beta. Right now you will find three extensions listed under recommended section that is dark reader, uBlock origin and global speed. There is no doubt that more extension will join the list soon. To install the extension, simply tap on the get button next to the extension of your choice. I will install dark reader and confirm the action by tapping on the add button. Once installation complete, it will appear under installed section. To manage the extension, tap on the three dot icon and select option of your choice. From this menu, toggle on or off the extension, get details about the extension, check permissions and remove the extension as well. After enabling the extension, I check the functionality offered by the extension and it works flawlessly. Right now the feature is available in the latest version of Edge Canary which users can download from Play Store. It's highly possible that when extension feature is rolled out in Edge for Android in stable channel, the extension feature will work similar to as shown in the video. If anything changes, I will definitely update the information in the blog post added in the description. So that's all about this video. What is your opinion about addition of extension support in Edge for Android? What extension you want to see in the Edge extensions list? Share your opinion in the comments. If you find this video useful, don't forget to like this video. Subscribe the channel for getting notifications about more similar videos. Thanks for watching.